our top story, Naperville fire investigators are still working to discover the cause of the three alarm fire that burned the Rosebud restaurant in downtown Naperville. On July 11th, 60 firefighters from more than 10 area departments were called in to fight the fire at the popular Naperville eatery. NCTV 17's Alex Simmons reports. This was the scene Sunday, July 11th at Rosebud Restaurant in downtown Naperville. Four days later, the corner is so quiet, you might not know anything happened. But the flames weakened the structure, and it took two days before investigators could begin work inside. We had to request a crane to uh, come in so that we could lift the HVAC units off the roof and the uh, uh, exhaust ducts off the roof so that we could get the weight off the roof to make it safe for people to go into the kitchen area. The roof also presented problems on Sunday when hot spots within the layers of roofing material contributed to what Zawanski called a stubborn blaze. He says when a business burns, there are many factors investigators consider. Just because of the, the nature of the operations, there's so many you know, cooking operations going on, there's lots of electric, there's all different types of things you know, being at, uh, in use at the same time. So you have to look at all the different possibilities and causes. At this point, it's not clear whether the Rosebud owners plan to rebuild or what the impact would be on downtown. Well, it, it would be disappointing if we were to lose them. I'm not going to speculate at this point on what their intentions are, what their plans are. I'm sure they're evaluating everything at this time. And while fans of Rosebud will have to wait and see if the restaurant will continue to operate in Naperville, the complex investigation is ongoing. Reporting from downtown Naperville, Alex Simmons, Naperville News 17. This is not the first time Naperville's Rosebud restaurant fell victim to a fire. In fact, four years ago to the week, a blaze started in the kitchen.